Okay, what's up guys? Welcome to the channel. If you're new here, welcome back if you're an OG. And yeah, this is going to be a quick video. I'm going to show you how to create a nice emission material. It's not going to be just emission uh, material. It's going to look pretty cool. So let's jump into it. It's really easy. Let's jump into it. So sh first thing I'm going to do is go Shift A, Mesh, Monkey. We want to add our emission kind of material thingy mobobby onto this. Okay. Then what you want to do is go here with the object selected, boom, add modifier, type in subdivision surface, add that, and then just bring it up to two, right click, shade smooth. Okay, then it's got a shading, so boom, let's go here, zoom in, shift, and then hit new, bring this up, then what you want to do is make sure in cycles so boom cycle selected okay and what you want to do stick here bring the strings something like that we can make it darker later we just want to see what we're working with then first thing i want to do is bring this base color bring it all the way down to something like that then what you want to do is bring this yeah so click on the material output press shift a type in mix now that mix shader, so boom, boom. And then what you want to do is go Shift A, type in emission, add an emission shader, plug this in there. And then what you want to do is change this color, let's make it like a orange. Bring the strength up, maybe like eighteen. And then what you want to do is bring this up, bring this mix shader up. And then go Shift A, type in color. You want to get a color ramp. Plug the color into the factor, the mix shader. Then the next one you want to do is go Shift A again and add a layer weight. Plug the facing into the factor of the color ramp. Then change this blend. Let's make this 0 0.15. And then what you want to do is here where the magic happens. So click on this, bring this in, something like that. Bring the white. in and see if I go yeah so it's looking like you can see it even better if I go to EV so click yeah boom EV turn on bloom and you look how nice that's looking okay let's work in EV for now just so we can see better because if you want to do it in cycles with the Z low you need to Go to compositing, add a glare node. And what you can do is you can change this. And you can play with that. You can change it to beast plan if you want. That also looks pretty cool. And you can also bring this like that, bring this in. So you have control of like how much detail you want, that kind of stuff. And then obviously, you know, if you want to change the color, can play around with that, bring this in, play with that, that also looks pretty cool. And then, as you can see if I go here to cycles, now it looks even better with B spline. You can see if I go back to linear, it doesn't look as good. Okay, so make sure that you are in B spline, you can change this to constant, but you can see that looks terrible. And that's the video, so. It's a material, it's really easy and it looks really cool. And you can try this on different objects, you can try this on like whatever you want, basically any kind of object and it will look pretty cool. And yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the video. I'll upload this to the Patreon. So if you're a member, you can download this material setup for free. Obviously if you're a member. But yeah, that's the video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't. Helps me out. Feel free to check out the Patreon, like I said, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.